Treasury Minister Don Polier has signed a loan agreement of 83 million US dollars with the Asian Development Bank. The agreement was signed in India during the 46th ADB Board of Governors meeting. These funds will be used to upgrade grid and transmission of power in Port Moresby. He also met with JICA to upgrade the Yonki hydropower at a cost of 2 billion kina. First outcome was the very important highlight of the signing of the loan uh, agreement between the Asian Development Bank and Papua New Guinea. And I uh, acted on behalf of the state in signing the loan uh, for an appro approximately 83 uh, million US dollars uh, to uh, upgrade the grid and the transmission of power uh, into uh, all parts of uh, uh, Port Mosby. I'm glad I've uh, signed that. I'm happy uh, because it is, it's, a, it's a small uh, step in the right direction to making sure that we improve the supply of power in Papua New Guinea. Uh, and I have, in relation to, relation to that, I've also met with the uh, JICA. Uh, JICA was also going to be was also involved in uh, doing the uh, power, uh, the great uh, upgrade project on the uh, Yonggi power. A grid system throughout the Mamasa and the Highlands region. And I had meetings with them uh, where uh, they have also uh, placed their support uh, that they like to take up that. And I gave them as a first, uh, first phase of the project. And I'm happy I've met with them because I like to really improve power in PNG. In the meantime, John Tangit says load shedding in Port Moresby will continue for an indefinite period. This follows the breakdown of a turbine generator at Kanudi Power Station last Friday. The Kanudi generator supplies 10 megawatts of electricity to Port Moresby. PNG Power personnel are working to address technical issues, but in the meantime, business houses are urged to use backup generators. Consumers can call the Port Moresby 24-hour customer service on 323-4774 or 7198-1000.